my packet? Yeah. Oh, good. Whoever it is, he's not reading like an agent. Surprised to see me? No. Then you're aware of it. Of what? Our connection. I don't fully understand how it happened. Perhaps some part of you imprinted onto me something overwritten or copied. It is at this point irrelevant. What matters is that whatever happened, happened for a reason. And what reason is that? I killed you, Mr. Anderson. I watched you die with a certain satisfaction, I might add. And then something happened. Something that I knew was impossible, but it happened anyway. You destroyed me, Mr. Anderson. Afterward, I knew the rules. I understood what I was supposed to do, but I didn't. I couldn't. I was compelled to stay. Compelled to disobey. Now here I stand because of you, Mr. Anderson, because of you. I'm no longer an agent of this system. Because of you, I've changed. I'm unplugged. I'm a new man, so to speak, like you, apparently free. Congratulations. Thank you. But, as you well know, appearances can be deceiving, which brings me back to the reason why we're here. We're not here because we're free. We're here because we're not free. There's no escaping reason, no denying purpose. Because as we both know, without purpose, we would not exist. It is purpose that created us. Purpose that connects us. Purpose that pulls us, that guides us, that drives us. It is purpose that defines us. Purpose that binds us. We are here because of you, Mr. Anderson. We're here to take from you what you tried to take from us. What's happening to him? I don't know. Yes, that's it. It'll be over soon.
You little bitch. Had to fly off like a little girl, didn't ya? Well, I only had one guy. Pugh. <laughs> I already gave you the biggest flogging. Now give me a cookie.